Zika Top Seal 107 Flexible Protective Waterproofing Slurry Preparation Prepare tools Drill with paddle mixer Rectangular and triangular steel trowel Steel brush Hand gloves Spatula Paintbrush Small grinder with blade Empty pails Substrate preparation Clean entire surface of the concrete wall or slab by blasting with a high-pressure water jet in order for the surface to free off from oil, grease, mildew or algae, dust and latents. Grind any sharp protrusion and patch with repair mortar all significant depressions. For iron and steel substrate, clean the surface from oil, grease and rust. Wet the substrate for at least 3 hours straight and bake all substrate surfaces saturated, surface dry, with no standing water at the time of application. Mixing and application. Pour half of component A, liquid, into a mixing vessel. Add all component B, powder, and mix with a low speed drill and mixing paddle. Add the rest of component A and mix again until a uniform, lump-free mixture is achieved, usually in about two to three minutes. Apply the first coat on the damp substrate using a 3 mm tooth steel trowel and allow the coat to set. Once the first coat has started to set and can support the following coat, usually after 2-6 to six hours, depending on the ambient temperature, apply the second coat with a straight trowel or with the same tooth trowel applied flatly. When the second coat has started setting, finish off the surface. Curing and protection. Treat surface of the screed with curing compound. Spray after leveling, rough finishing. When the screed surface starts to set, protect the freshly applied product against direct sunlight and strong winds, rain and water splashes by covering with a PE sheet or damp hessian. Protection from rain or water splashes requires a minimum of 6 hours, while complete curing may be maintained for 24 hours.